Chiefs of Navy, heads of uh, Coast Guards, Maritime Police and other maritime organisations, distinguished guests, mariners, ladies and gentlemen. Um, good afternoon and welcome to the first session. It's good to be into this first session, which of course focuses on the importance of the Indian Ocean and after all that is why we are here. As Adam indicated, I'm your moderator for this session. Uh, the Minister Cash, who will remember um, in her keynote speech this, mor this morning, highlighted the scope and the breadth of the Indian Ocean. Um, and uh, even the ions uh, symbol itself and the map that was up there briefly this morning as well, I guess highlights the, uh, the importance of, of security and good order at sea and making sure that uh, even those that are on the beachfront or those that have an interest there, uh, things are looked after. Well, this session aims to up provide upfront context uh, for the conference's theme. Uh, Vice Admiral Griggs talked about it in his opening address this morning, taking over as the chair, uh, protecting the ability to trade in the Indian Ocean maritime economy. Uh, this session has three parts, uh, two speakers, and uh, we're most fortunate to have uh, Pres Professor Michael Lestrange and Commodore Lee Cordner uh, to present on the importance of the Indian Ocean, and I'll introduce their topic shortly. Uh, they'll present uh, individually their papers, I'll introduce them individually, and then there'll be a question and answer time of approximately 25 minutes. Uh, while it's characterised as a question and answer session, I think uh, given that this is actually a seminar, um, there is value in, uh, in people providing uh, some comment and, and seeking clarification of, uh, of what our speakers uh, have presented. Um, as Adam indicated this morning, there's also the comments in the margin session tomorrow afternoon that provides another opportunity uh, for that commentary. To our first speaker, uh, Professor Michael Estrange uh, is well known to those uh, in strategic policy and foreign relations circles. He's had a most significant career in academia and public service at the highest levels, and in recent years served as Australia's High Commission in the, to the United Kingdom. He's also been the Secretary of our Department of Foreign Affairs and Trade. He was a Rhodes Scholar, uh, was a recipient of the Harkness Scholarship in the United States and was made an officer in the Order of Australia some years ago for his service to public policy development and implementation, uh, particularly in the areas of national security and foreign policy. Professor Lestrange has been the head of the College of National Security at the Australian National University in Canberra since 2009. The title of his paper, An Overview of Indian Ocean Security Architecture. Would you please welcome Professor Lestrange. 